All right, guys, welcome back to another video. As you can see, I have this giant box next to me and I'm happy to announce this is my second year with Castle X and we have some goodies in here, some new stuff that we haven't ran before and I'm making a change this year that is gonna be really exciting, so stay tuned. All right, let's start off with the very first item. Um, I This is a new thing for me, okay? I have never in my life ran a mono suit before, and this year we are running the Freedom Mono Suit in the process blue, white, and black. And as you can see, this thing looks killer. So I can't wait to run this and do a review on this mono suit. I think it's going to be awesome. Um, from everything I've heard from everybody, mono suit's the way to go, and um, I've always been a jacket pant guy. So we'll see how we like it, but. I can tell you right now, if this is anything like my flex jacket and pant combo, this is gonna hold up and this is gonna last all season long, no problem. So look at that colorway though, isn't that so sick? I'm really pumped about this. So um, as I do with all my castle gear, I'm going to give a full review of how I like this and what I think. Um, and uh, man, I'm, I'm excited. All right, let's move on. We got some good, good stuff in here. All right. The next thing we have is our Fusion mid-layer. And I ran this last year. I cannot tell you guys how comfortable this thing is. So we got it again in the blue color. It's gonna look so sick. Castle went out of their way and changed their colors up a little bit on all their stuff. And this blue is going to match so well, not only um, as a gear set, but with my sled color too coming up. You guys will see that, um, but this mid layer is awesome. You're gonna wear this underneath your mono suit. You're gonna wear this out and about. Um, I mean, it looks so dang good. So the redesign that they have done and the way they've changed some of this stuff up is it's killer. So um, this is the Fusion mid layer. Um, I wear an extra large. I am 5'11", 225 pounds. So um, give you guys an idea and this fits perfectly. All right, and next we've got probably one of my most favorite products from Castle X, and that is going to be the Barrier Jacket. This Barrier Jacket, I wear this thing in the winter nearly every day. Um, this is one of the coolest jackets you'll ever wear. Um, it's, it looks so good in the blue, I'm so excited. Uh, as you can see, my theme is blue and yellow this year, so um, lots of change. Um, from that bright uh, color that we had last year. So anyway, um, fleece inside, okay. Pockets, all zipper waterproof um, or water resistant, that is. This thing is amazing, especially when it is raining outside or you got that freezing rain. This is gonna keep you warm. This is a total wind barrier too. Um, one of the warmest jackets I own by far and it's lightweight enough and it's stylish enough that you wanna wear it all the time. So. This is the Barrier Jacket from Castle X. Go check it out, super sick. All right, now the next thing that we have here, this year because we're running a mono suit, um, I opted to get some layers to go underneath um, all of my gear. And this is going to be the Fusion Mid-Layer Bottom. So this is actually uh, just like the Fusion Top. The material is almost identical, but it is the bottom. This will fit underneath me um, inside my mono suit. So I don't have to wear anything else other than this if I want to. And uh, it's gonna keep me plenty warm. So um, this is gonna be your mid-layer insulation underneath your mono suit. You could wear it if you have, you know, pants and stuff like that, but you're gonna be toasty, that's for sure. So Fusion mid-layer, really nice, really nice material. All right, let's mix it up a bit here. I am pumped about these. This year, I decided to go with the Stage 2 goggles. Last year, we ran the Stage, and I'm pretty sure they have discontinued them now. But, oh my goodness. Look at that blue lens. That is going to be the sickest goggle. I can't wait. Um, these are over-the-glass goggles, too, so you can put them on if you are like me, somebody that wears glasses, and it fits just fine. Um, oh my gosh, it's going to look good. I got a pair of the blue tinted lens with the blue frame and the black frame with the black tinted lens. I love a black tinted lens. So um, these are gonna be killer. And these are specifically designed to work with the Castle X off-road helmets. Um, 
I have the CX100 and we have a new color in the box. You'll see in just a moment. All right, next thing we have is our regulator base layer pant. Now this base layer pant, this is going to be what you would wear underneath. Um, if you're wearing knee pads, knee braces, something like that, this is that layer that goes in between your body and um, your mid layer, or you could just wear this along with your mono suit and get away with it that way. So really thin material, um, a little bit of dust on there, but really, really nice. Um, and this, this will insulate you just a little bit. Moisture wicking, you know, that kind of stuff. So um, regulated base layer, that's gonna be handy to have. All right, the next thing we have here is our TRS Balclava. Okay, um, for you Canadians, Balclava, I think you guys pronounce it. Um, anyway, this is gonna be really nice. Um, I opted for the, um, they, have, they have another um, Balclava that has a breath box kind of vent in it, so it funnels everything down. And uh, anyway, I opted for this one that will keep me just a little bit warmer, I think. Um, so I'm excited to try this. I've been running the same one for like five, four years now. Um, well, longer than that, because my very first time I snowmobiled, I wore the one that I have now. So it's lasted forever. But anyway, the TRS Flex Balclava there. Next, we have my, oh, man, I got so many favorites with Castle. It's not even funny. Um, this is the Mission Glove. I got another pair of these. These gloves, in my opinion, are the best glove on the market as far as your daily riding goes. This is that glove that is not insulated enough that um, it's gonna be so warm and you're gonna sweat your hands off, but insulated enough it'll keep you warm on nearly every single ride. Um, so now I will have two pairs of these to run and switch back and forth for when they get sweaty and wet, things like that. But the Mission Gloves, by far, I highly recommend one of the best gloves out there. Oh, I can't reach. And, oh, the new ones. I haven't tried these yet. Way excited about these ones. These are the, oh, the launch glove. Okay, so these are, as you can see, there's no, um, I guess, elastic that runs around these. They just unstrap right here. They're very, very similar to my Mission Glove, but they're more lightweight, okay? These are gonna be the gloves you have when you're ready to just shred an area, but you don't need that protection of, you know, like trail riding or when you're going a long distance and your hands are gonna get a little bit cold. So, oh, these are sweet. These are better than I imagined. Um, I can't tell you how happy I am with Castle and their products. Um, there's a reason I'm with them. There's a reason I plan on staying with them. They do have some of the best products out there, if not the best, for sure. Um, what is this? This is gonna be Oh, the regulator base layer crew neck top. I'm gonna probably run this every single time I ride. So this is gonna go up here on top of me. Um, and you know, this will obviously be your base layer for everything. So especially if you guys are wearing armor or anything like that, like a chest protector, um, for instance, this is gonna be really good to have underneath it and uh, put a barrier between your body and uh, whatever else. So. Um, okay, we're on to the goodies here, the big stuff. Now, uh, if you guys have followed me for a while, you know I ran the Castle X Force 2 boots last year. This year, I wanted to go with the A-tops. I wanted to try them. And let me pull these out of the bag here and show you. Look at the packaging. They go, they go above and beyond. This is some of the nicest gear you'll ever see. Um, okay, these are the A-top boot. What is different about that? We got the boa on it, okay? The boa is so sweet. The boa is gonna be really handy. To loosen it, you just turn that way, tighten it, turn that way, and you can suck it down to contour your foot. So no more laces. I'm excited about it. Um, a lot of people uh, love this boa system. I mean, you can see how easy it is. You just pop it loose, do that, and then wind it up, and you are ready to ride, just like that. So, A top boots, go check them out. Um, and the nice thing about the Castle X boots is they have so much protection. Not only are they gonna keep you warm, but the protection is amazing on these. The toe box is super strong. Um, I, I, I absolutely love my Castle boots. Um, the Force 2 are great. These are gonna be just as good, I know it. Okay, last but not least, 
All right, let's put the box down here since I'm running out of room. This is going to be our CX100 carbon fiber helmet. Um, if you guys have never run a carbon fiber helmet, you don't know what living life is like. It is amazing. Look at that black carbon fiber. Let me get closer for you guys. Check that thing out. It is so, so nice, okay? Um, the large on these is 1,250 grams, super lightweight. I mean, this is just, it's, it's featherweight. I cannot wait to ride with this again. Um, honestly, it's very weird if you've never had a carbon helmet before. You put this on and it feels like you're not wearing anything. It is crazy how lightweight these helmets are. And, you know, DOT approved for you guys that are trail riders, stuff like that. They hit the highway every once in a while. Um, sick helmet. Um, I will put a mount on this for my action cam. We're running a DJI this year. It's going to be fun. Um, so I'll show you guys how I do that. But that is my unboxing of my Castle X gear for 23-24 snowmobile season. Um, I can't tell you how excited I am. It's so exciting. Um, this stuff is top of the line, guys. Um, like I said, there's a reason why I'm working with Castle X because they make the best the best apparel out there for snowmobiling by far. So go check it out, castlesells.com. Look up what you need. Um, and a lot of their stuff is on sale right now. In fact, this uh, carbon helmet right now, this is on sale for almost $100 off. So snag it while you can get it, okay? Um, carbon helmets are expensive. Again, thank you so much, Castle, for supporting me. Um, I'm excited to get off, kick off this snowmobile season right. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the mountain. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you in the next one.